channel. In today's video, I am going to be filming a pack with me vlog, pack with me video. It's not really going to be a vlog. I tried filming this introduction about 17,000 times. I really can't do it today. Like, my mind is just all over the place. I'm so tired, and you know when you're just speaking a literal load of. And that is me right now. So, apologies in the video if I feel, if I sound like. I don't know what I'm talking about because I really don't, like I'm so tired but do you know what, I promised this video and I'm delivering this video because I already filmed one of these for my last holiday to Mallorca. I just looked awful, I was like I am not uploading this, I genuinely look like a thumb. Look at me now, I, have I made an effort? No. I'm just gonna get it done, I'm just gonna have a cosy little pack with me video. So I've got my joggers on, I'm sat here with my suitcase and my clothes, I go on holiday tomorrow go to Ibiza tomorrow and um, I'm not sorted yet so a bit of backstory four nights I'm going for so I'm just a bit like ugh, I've got way too much clothes for four nights I've got way too many outfits it's not adding up I've got about 17 going out outfits and about 17 day outfits and I'm going for four days but I'm just gonna show you them all and if there's anything you particularly like and want me to wear let me know in the comments because I need some help of choosing which ones actually are going to make the cut for this holiday because there's too many nice bits that I just could not resist buying. This is what I've um, bought to travel in. It's this like waffle material. That's such a weird name for a material isn't it but it literally is called that I think. From ASOS it's like um, a neony pink colour and then this is the back it's got like some schools on. It says infinite energies. I just thought this was cute. I got this in like a size 6 but it's super oversized. I'm glad that I just went for like a smaller size because if I'd have got like a 10 like I was going to it would be way too big. So I just got this and I've got these all poly shorts which match perfectly that I've already got at home. So I thought this oversized shirt, my chunky Balenciaga trainers and probably like my bum bag because it's really really easy to just throw on over. Um, my traveling outfit with my, my passport and everything in that is a cute um airport outfit so i'm trying to think what to show you first should i show you daytime stuff first yeah let's do that so the first thing is this sheen bikini set so these are the bottoms super funky like a really cool groovy funky print comes with the matching top why is this tied so weird oh okay because i feel like i've been liking tight in the bikinis like upside down i feel like everyone has at the moment and um, I just tried it on like that, so it's tied the way I'm gonna wear it. This did come with a little mesh skirt, which is somewhere in my room that I can't be bothered to find yet, but I'm gonna pack that as well because I think I might wear this for like, I don't know, this is the thing. This is a potential option for like Ibiza Rocks pool party. We're staying at Ibiza Rocks. Is my fake tan actually like this around my neck? Okay, let's just pretend that it wasn't. Option number one. The next thing that I got, which let's be honest this is going to be have to be the option because how bloody beautiful is this jaded london bikini top in this gorgeous tropically abstract funky print with the matching bottoms i think this is gonna to have to be my ibiza rocks pool party outfit because i love this thinking of wearing it with these chunky black sandals from misguided how cute and finally to finish off the outfit, I bought the matching sarong, which like ties at the side, just like this, around your waist. What do we think? I think this is gonna have to be the winning outfit for Ivy the Rocks. The sheen one is really, really pretty though, but like, I'm here be, if I'm having like a day at the pool or whatever, I can put this one on. So that's the first thing I treat myself to from Jade of London because their stuff at the moment for spring, summer, beautiful. So while we're on day in London, I'll show you the next bits, okay. So this is going to be my ocean outfit. So the top is really hard to show. It basically crosses round. It's one of them crisscross ones. Ties around your neck. It's impossible to show, but it is adorable. And then it ties, this bit ties around your tummy. It's quite, it's quite a complicated bikini top. It comes with these bottoms. Now, I'm not going to lie. When I ordered this, I was like, I don't know why I ordered this. I feel like it's going to be really unflattering on me, like these rings at the side i was like i feel like they're literally gonna not be flattering if i'm a bit bloated and like my hips are coming through but these are actually really really nice like the way that these sit are like above your hips so like they're just flattering on 
I love them. So that. And it comes with like this skirt. So I feel like I'm going to wear this like walking into Ocean Beach. And then like if I want to like dip to the loo. Do you know what I mean? Sometimes I feel like when you're wearing like heels and a bikini. You want like something covering your bum. Like when you're like walking around. I get like a bit self-conscious so i love this because it obviously matches i've actually got some shoes coming from ego i think they're pink i've completely forgot i kind of just did a panic order today um to go with this because i think heels at ocean is like a must like i feel like it just makes your outfit look more posh do you know what i mean so that is my ocean beach outfit this is um a cute little bikini which i'm just gonna use for the pool i think like a pool day bikini again cute abstract print this kind of goes over your neck around here like no one does bikinis normally these days do they so that is from boohoo comes with some really really nice high-waisted bottoms i love a high-waisted bottom i've actually not got many of these it's like in my bikini collection this summer and so yeah i don't really have any like plans for that outfit in particular but i thought they'd be cute with this orange shirt which i also got from boohoo it's quite creased actually i'm gonna have to iron this before i go but i just think this over the top of this bikini literally could be just snip into the shops like going out for like food for a bit of lunch with some shorts on I love it. Another shirt that I got from Boohoo is this like hot pink one because you can't just you just can't have too many oversized shirts when you're on holiday just to chuck over a bikini. A few things which haven't arrived yet, such as them shoes and then the swimsuit to match this bandana. This is the bandana that I got, so it's basically like um, a Dior monogram inspired print. I have got the matching swimsuit to come with this, which I'm gonna wear to this beach club that we've booked oh, my friends booked it and we basically booked it because molly may was there we we're like we're going she's there it must be good we're booking it we needed a day plan for like one of the days so we're going there but i feel like it's not like a bright funky vibe i feel like it's more like a classy vibe so i thought this bandana sunglasses a swimsuit i'm just feeling this outfit but the swimsuit hasn't come yet they did actually just send me the wrong thing they sent me a bikini which doesn't match this so i was like please can you send me the swimsuit like for Tuesday please 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 and she was like yeah it's fine so hopefully that's coming probably end up wearing that with them black shoes again because that's just that just matches doesn't it like I don't think really it's a heel type vibe where we're going but um yeah I love that so that's hopefully gonna come tomorrow okay another thing that I'm packing for the day which I actually took this on my last holiday and I got so much wear out of it is the um is this like little crochet two-piece from ASOS it's like a lemon yellow like scalloped crop top it looks so nice with the tan lemon yellow looks amazing with a tan and it comes with like the matching flare bottoms I'm gonna chop these tonight though because I wore these on holiday and they are so long they were trailing along the floor and they've got a little bit dirty so I'm just gonna snip the bottoms off them because honestly these are not made for someone that's five foot four like they're made for a supermodel or something because they don't fit me like how long I'm gonna show you now the stuff that I picked up from Primark today um, because they had a few nice bits and I just thought let's do a little holiday haul treat myself so wake up wipes I also got a little mini um got to be glued hairspray because it's the best hairspray in the world tanning oil i also got this little lemon yellow set i feel like you can't tell that that's yellow on here but i've always wanted i've been wanting one of these ribbed lemon yellow sets for ages and i thought this is like dead comfy for holiday like i hate itchy underwear in the heat absolute no no from me so i thought i'd treat myself to that i thought this is a nice little holiday set to wear i got myself just some little lashes to put out of a night time and also these aren't from primark actually these are from new look i just popped them in the bag some new sunglasses because i only just bought some like this and i lost them in Mallorca, so i needed to repurchase because i just love a good sunglass like this i just feel like they're just the typical go-to sunglass that suits me and you're not ready for this it's the best bit best bit it made me rethink my apple outfit but we're sticking with it this is the dupe for the zara green shirt which i really want and it sold out online i found it in primark it's 13 pound but it's like that stunning green that literally is the exact same as the zara shirt i thought this would be so nice with like a white cycling short and crop top 
trainers for like the airport but then I was looking all around town trying to find a white crop top and cycling shorts and just nothing was there so I don't know if it's too late now to order that and I've already got an airport outfit so I don't really know what I'm wearing that for but that could be a cute outfit for home I might not pack that because I do already have an orange shirt and a pink shirt over night time the first night we're going to Mambo's so I'll show my options for that obviously Mambo's is just like tea drinks sunset drinks type thing another little j london piece i thought this this reminded me of the sunset so i thought how could i not get this dress for members it's a beautiful backless dress and when i say this is backless i mean like this is a very low back but i just think that looks so flattering on um it's super short and to be fair like it's um this is swaying towards you probably do need to have smaller size boobs to wear this because even me with hardly any is worried about these popping out because it's just not very secure do you know what i mean like it's very like hanging loose don't know what color heels though let me know because i'm genuinely not sure what to pack i've seen a girl wear it with red heels and it looks nice but i'm also thinking like pink what do we think i do not actually know orange probably orange let me know but that is an option for Mambo's. Okay, the next thing that I got, which I do love, and I kind of do like the idea of a nice long maxi dress for uh, Mambo's, like for tea and drinks and stuff. Yeah, it's hard to show, but basically it's like a crisscross. Leaves out some little cutouts in your chest. And it's just like a tie around the neck type vibe, and it's super long, some slits up the legs. I feel like this with some nice sunnies, hair in like a, a pony or like a bun with some sandals. That is just a nice chilled vibe for like the first night when we're not doing anything too fancy. The next thing I'm packing is these unreal flares. They're like in a groovy, swirly pink, green, orange print. So stunning. And they come with it showing tops like this on camera because it's so hard to explain. But you get the drift. They're like a little strappy tie around the neck halter um, with the matching flares. How groovy are these? These are from an Instagram brand called Made by Millie. Okay, I really want to wear this outfit to Wiki Woo. I'm going to Wiki Woo for tea and a few drinks. I think it might be on the Thursday night. This crochet skirt, oh, look at it. I hope I'm not flashing that. It's from Mermaids on Instagram. Yeah, I'm going to have to wear like a pink bikini bottom underneath. I just got these ones from Pre-LT that I already had. And I'm going to wear it with just like a bikini top. And I've also got like a little matching necklace which has got like shells on it because i feel like it's that kind of vibe isn't it it's a bit like um beachy boho -y vibe but i just love that i feel like with a tan all the different colors it's just an ibiza vibe like i'm obsessed with that outfit the thing that i didn't get a chance to wear on holiday which i absolutely love i'm gonna have to wear it one of the nights is this gorgeous collar from casella studios so this is a skirt as you can see it's quite low waisted but it's kind of like high waisted but like it scoops down into the tummy area which i love and then it comes with a little cross around top which looks weird off but yeah you get the dress it's like a that kind of top and with probably the white heels that are going to come tomorrow i'll pack them because i feel like they'll go with quite a lot of stuff and it'll save me by bringing loads of different heels that is a really cute outfit um maybe for the last night or something we don't actually have anything planned booked for the last night but we're just gonna like see where it takes us um so that is a cute little vibe for that towards the bottom of a pile and i've just found that skirt that i was on about that goes with that first sheen bikini i really wish i booked a week because there's just no way that i'm gonna be able to get around to wearing all these things last but not least this um swimsuit i was meant to take this to me i forgot to pack it but i think this is cute i saw someone wearing this for ocean actually with high heels it looked amazing if for any reason something happens to one of my other bikinis and I can't wear my ocean bikini, I feel like this is a good little alternative with like some high heels, a nice swimsuit, it's backless. Another little sheen find that I was like £12, something like that. Not gonna lie, I didn't really pack them very neatly, so I'm gonna be Abby and show you when my case is a lot more put together. I'm gonna go sort that out. I'm gonna go actually make it look presentable. I'll check back in when I'm a little bit more sorted and organised, but that is the haul basically. I might check back in also once a few more of my parcels arrive tomorrow. And if they don't, then I'll check back in and have a bit of a breakdown. So yeah. Good morning guys. So it's now the next day. Right, so I'm just gonna show you a few bits that have just arrived. So the Dior swimsuit, which I was on about, the bandana matches, um, is arrived. 
I love it. I think this with like black chunky sandals. Another thing which had actually arrived yesterday, but my camera cut off halfway through me speaking through like this clip and um i just thought i'd show you rather than try and edit it in um but the, this is like my favorite thing of the entire haul so that's why i thought i'm just gonna have to film this this morning and show you these flares from elsie and fred i'm obsessed and then it comes with a matching halter neck yeah the matching halter neck I love it. Ego shoes arrived. I'm going to show you some. So the first pair, the white ones, and these are ones that I'm going to wear with the majority of like my going out outfits, just because they're white. They go with everything. Um, I'm going to wear them with the all my flare outfits because I feel like it will elevate the flares off the floor. These are the white shoes. Sorry, but how extra are these? Like, I just love them. They've got like a snake print bit here, but then these are just like a chunky don't really know the material to be honest but they're just very bougie i love them these other ones are pink ones i'm gonna wear with my ocean beach bikini they're not as chunky as obviously the other ones but they're still like a kind of chunky heel so hopefully be comfy bit of a platform i just felt like the pink matched the pink on the swimsuit it's like the exact match so i was like these are just gonna have to be the shoe to go with um so yeah i'm gonna stop babbling now and i'm gonna finish packing and i'll show you the finished result of the case when it's all neat and tidy and i'm ready to set off okay so we're all packed this is so satisfying like to look at i feel proud because i've never packed this neatly before but i've also just filmed like a little pack with me tiktok video and it was so satisfying like doing all the transitions to move it into the suitcase so i just wanted to make it all neat and tidy but yeah all my outfits are here and then on this side, I've just packed like hair dryer, rollers, I've got a hair curler there. I think Katie's bringing straighteners so we don't have to bring them. I've got some bags in there, like toiletries, brushes, shoes. So they're all securely in there. I'm just gonna try and wear this case before I set off just because I really am nervous about paying for the extra luggage because I don't need everything in this case, but I have took a couple of things out. Um, I've took out um, like knitted flares because I feel like they're quite heavy. I've took out some pairs of shoes. I've just had to say bye bye to some things because it's just impossible. Also, if anyone's looking at my nails thinking, Chloe, that is not like you, like you're going on holiday with nails like this. Um, I have actually saved the ones that I've pinged off and I'm going to just glue them with nail glue to my nails and bring the nail glue with me to keep them on because we've lost a couple and i'm a bit sad about it but we'll be fine and we're just going to do that uh, this afternoon what time are we on to now i'm going to sit and edit the rest of this video get that uploaded um before we set off at five and yeah i think that's it so i'll, I'll be seeing you in my vlog for the ibiza vlog so i'm obviously going to be vlogging that but make sure you watch that that'll be up on home next week and i hope you enjoyed this video guys i will see you all in my next one bye, bye.